Chess friends, today God played the King's Indian attack variation against Stockfish 15. The King's Indian setup looks like this, knight here, castle. You can play g3, d3, but I will recommend you to play knight f3. Perfect, now you have these moves. d5, g3. Knight c6, then e5 is a boring move, because of d4. So we have better move c5. Bishop g2, knight f6 we have castle, well his idea is to play like this, a4 opening up the position, d3, bishop here, or d4 instead of d3. Black should not play d4, let me show the variation, c3, if it takes then knight takes. So knight here takes, takes. Queen out to a4 pinning the knight and targeting the pawn with the knight. If bishop g4 happens, then take the pawn, if queen takes, then bishop takes knight check, and black will lose his queen early. So back to the position, we have knight c6. God and I recommend you to play d4, if takes then knight takes. But many players play d3 that's why God will teach you how to play the d3 move in the king's Indian setup. Your further move is e4, c4 and knight bd2, even a4. Fish played e5. You have this kind of move, e4 and knight here. God played e4, standard opening. If takes, then take it, queen takes, rook takes queen, if knight takes pawn, then knight takes e5, knight takes, then bishop takes e4. Position will be open, white will get some advantages. So black decided to lock the position by playing the d4. You can play knight bd2 or a4. God played a4, preventing b5 square, knight jumps into c4, so black and play b5 himself. Bishop here, knight a3, castle, we have bishop d2, h6. You can play knight h4 or knight e1, to play f4. God played knight e1, preparing f4. a6, a4. If pawn takes, then g takes, threatening e5, so, bishop here, and play like this. Queen f3, king slides on h1, queen here, rook here, bishop f3, the gh files are totally open for rook and queen, bishop takes h3, it can't take, because of this. This is the strategy of god. So, we have bishop c7. f5, White wants this. Black can't attack because of his own pawn structure, so, white develops his pawn on the king side, we have rook b8, g4, god wants h4. So bishop here, try to eliminate the bishop, your bishop is more worthy, because of this, rook here, in the future dark square bishop is necessary to open the g-file. So, bishop c1. a5, God sacrifices a pawn temporarily. You can't take it, because of this, queen here, queen h4, king here, rook h1. The h file will be open if you take the pawn. So, h5. Knight d2, targeting the pawn, and threading this. Again you can't take the f-pawn, takes, then the h-pawn will be undefended. Knight e4 is a thread. Knight f1, creating some source of support. Bishop takes h5, God sacrificed his bishop, Stockfish accepted it. Queen takes h5, targeting the knight, so rook here, if you think f6 is the best move, try to move the rook. So you will get the knight. However f6 is not possible, because of this, king takes g2, then queen takes pawn. Position will be equal. So, knight h2, god wants knight g4, preparing for f6.
b3, pausing move, best was to play knight g4, according to me. You can't take the queen, let me show the variation. g takes h6. Now you can't stop the pawn from promoting. So, we have queen f3. If rook g8, sacrificing your knight, then. Threatening bishop b4, try to slide your queen, then queen takes rook, and I have aggressive pawns. So, back to the position, fishy played knight takes pawn. Pawn takes knight is not possible, because of this, queen takes check, king takes. Rook takes, bishop takes. It will be 3 versus 2. So, rook takes f6, bishop takes f6 is not possible because of this, you have to move your king, then bishop here, you have to move your queen, then queen takes rook. So, in this position, we have rook c5, blocking the bishop's diagonal, bishop b4 anyway. And after some moves later, it's a checkmate. Hope you learn King's Indian attack successfully. Wish you all the best, thanks for watching, subscribe for more, bye bye, take care, see you in my next video.